Well, I don't know what happened. We were just finishing with Sergeant on the nail clipping and picked up uh, Freedom, our little girl, our little seal colored girl, and my video went off. For some reason, I don't know if I maxed out, I don't know, but I didn't know if you could. But anyway, we'll just do two parts. This is Freedom. She's a little seal, CKC, Boston Terrier, with a beautiful blaze and uh, uh, nice white down for, for uh, the back of her neck. She's got white toes all the way around. And she is available. And she's just the sweetest little thing. And she definitely needs her nails done. Yes, her does. This litter is Abby's litter. They're the CKC babies that I have. They're the last CKC babies I'm going to have. Because Abby just retired and all my other Bostons are AKC. Tell me, baby. They were born uh, November 11th on Veterans Day. They were born just three days before Delilah's babies. But there's a huge difference in their nails. These, these babies, their nails are quite a bit thicker compared to Delilah's babies. Come on, don't get all upset on me. You just stay right there and I will take care of you. Now you're going to be fussy, aren't you? The key is to get it done as quick as I can because the longer I'm messing with her, the more fussy she's going to get. Yeah, the more fussy she's going to get. really not that fussy. It just makes me nervous when I'm using clippers on them because they jerk or move the wrong way. I would hate to take off more. And sometimes the clippers try to clip two nails at once and I don't like that. That makes me nervous. But we did it. We did it. We did it. You're all done, pretty girl. So, Freedom is looking for her own little family. She'll be ready to go January, I think it's the 8th. Now, I still have two big boys. And I don't know. Yeah, you can see Mom. Mom's sitting here watching everything. She, <laughs> she just stays real close. She's an excellent mama. This is Duke, and I know I got us in the array of sunshine. Hey, baby. Oh, don't be so fussy. This is Duke. He is taken. Freedom and Sergeant are the only ones available in this litter. Duke, he's a big boy. He was the first one born, and uh, he's hitting almost two pounds. The captain is our little cream boy. He's right up there with him. They're both big babies. Little teddy bears. <gasps> yes, you are. Yes, you are. Their Abby's babies are trying to walk now. I'm going to have to get them out of the whelping bed in another couple of days probably because they're needing more solid ground to stand on. No, okay, okay, okay. I got you. I got you. I got you, baby. I got you. You just sit right there. Come on. Be my good boy. I can hold you, but I gotta have that foot too. There's a lot of things that go into raising healthy babies. They get coconut wipes, get wiped down with the coconut wipe. Of course, mom keeps them very clean too. 
actually mom and, and Delilah both come in and clean the babies often. They'll stand in here and do it together. Their moms are still sleeping with the babies and they will. You're all done, baby. You're all done. Say hi to everybody. Now your nails are trimmed up. Yeah. Okay. Good boy. And one last puppy to go. That's our little uh, captain, our cream boy. Oh, Duke, you're moving my camera. Let's move you. <laughs> see him. He's just moving right into my camera. Look at that. He's trying to walk. No, oh, Duke, what happened? Or, Captain, what happened? Did I just... Let's get you right here, pretty boy. Let's get you right here. Oh, you're so pretty. Okay, okay. Don't get, don't get worked up on me. Anyway, it's just a part of taking care and keeping the babies healthy, keeping the mamas healthy. As long as these babies' nails are short, they're not scratching mama or, or uh, causing any discomfort while they're nursing it can cause mom's problem if their nails aren't short enough to if they're scratching mom and, and causing her to bleed or, or be tender while nursing then we have a problem mastitis can set in or other various types of conditions that can bring about infections and things. I think I did that one, didn't I? Did we get them all? No, we still have the back ones to do. Let's do, I think it's just this foot, so I love it when they spread their toes out. That helps. But I think I did them. I took the point off. They still look a little long, but I think you're safe. You're not going to be scratching anybody or getting that fuzzy stuff under your nails. Just look how precious you are. Just look at you. I'd rather you see them than me. And now we can let them rest a few minutes. And then I'll disturb them again and get their beds all changed out. That's how we all. That's how we all, Mr. Duke. Look at that. Captain is literally walking. He's not just scooting anymore. Yep, this whelping bed is ready to, it's gonna, they're ready for me to get the bed out and just let them be on the solid pads. The whelping beds are the kitty pool, the little plastic, hard plastic kitty pools. And they're great for a whelping bed, but down underneath, you can see the, like the fish, those are, are they're kind of raised and it gets in the way when babies are learning how to walk. It turns their balance off. Stand up there, Duke. Don't just crawl. You can, there he goes. I don't know if you can see it because of that sunlight. Oh, anyway, Mom stayed right here. Yes, Mama, all of my pack need their nails done, too, so we'll be probably working on that today and tomorrow. Yes, I'm fixing to change out the bed. I can see it's dirty. I will get it. I will get it, Mama. I will. Anyway, that's how we do our baby's nails. <laughs>